Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how I've decorated my room at university and also give you some tips on how to store a lot of stuff in a small space. So this is what my room first looks like when I moved in. Obviously all my stuff hasn't been unpacked yet so it's all in boxes. Uh, I think it's a decent sized room. I have my own wardrobe and ensuite bathroom which is nice. Um, I have a really nice view of the sea as well and a good amount of storage. And then this is my room once I'd finished decorating everything. I really kind of went for a bohemian vibe. I like a lot of patterns and fairy lights. I also like to be surrounded by nature, so I bought some fake leaves because I'm really bad at taking care of real plants, although I do have one. I have these box shelves that I keep some of my stuff in, like alcohol, perfume, um, I have a little skull decoration that I keep up all year round because that's just me, um, I have my Harry Potter books, art supplies, just little things like that. And I put a few extra boxes on top of the shelves where I keep stuff like jumpers and that in. I use this box to keep all my electrical items in and keep them out of the way. That's all my glasses cases next to it by the way. Then at the end section I just have some random empty boxes and my speaker. So this is my view. I'm actually on the ninth floor so I'm quite high up. I was really lucky to be on the side of the building that looks out onto the sea as well. And you can see all the birdies. It's absolutely beautiful at sunset. I love it. I find it so calming. So moving on to my windowsill, this is my real plant that I mentioned previously. I also have some fairy lights, um, Harry Potter themed of course. I also have a little disco ball that my mum gave to me. Here's just some basic information about the halls that I live in and this is my medicine box. I have my little Mr. Men vitamins, <laughs> gotta do what you gotta do. And then down here I just keep some folders and stuff. I also keep backgrounds, um, like, like my Instagram backgrounds and stuff, just tucked behind my bed. Now onto my vanity or makeup area, which is probably my favourite part of the room, honestly. Um, I store some jewellery and stuff on top of my drawers. Then in my makeup drawers where I keep the majority of my makeup, I have just neutral eyeshadows, some colourful eyeshadows, um, all my eyelashes. Here I have my glitter drawer, my face paints and stuff like that, some more face paints. <laughs> And then I have contacts and latex, fake bloods, some sponges and lastly I have my random drawer which has an array of things like my fake tanning gloves which is so gross, ears, eyeballs, petals, just random stuff. <laughs> then as for the rest of my makeup setup that I tend to grab day to day I also have my photo board above it. To the right of the desk I have all my skincare stuff, I'm not going to talk you through everything because it's not a makeup storage video, but I will show you some bits and bobs. So on my photo board I just hang some necklaces and jewellery just to keep them untangled and I also have some inspirational quotes dotted about along with pictures of me and my friends and family and my cat of course. Then in these drawers I just keep some more skincare stuff for my body. I left this drawer empty because I knew I was going to be putting uni work in it at some point and then this drawer is just random stuff like stationery and batteries. I have this nice little full body mirror here and then we'll move into the bathroom. I went for sort of a grey theme. I 
have some more storage boxes in here so I can keep my stuff somewhat organized even though it doesn't really look it. And I have these little cups just to hold things that I tend to grab for a bit more often. I bought these fake plants just to add some colour to my bathroom but they came with like a orangey brown pot so I just painted them grey so that they match the bathroom aesthetic. And this is my shower, I enjoy it very much. My mother gave me this um, little storage thing to put all my body wash and things in and then up here I just have a hangy thing to put all my cleaning products in. Onto my wardrobe which is rather small, I bought some drawers for all my socks and things like that. Um, and it's kind of dark inside so I bought some lights from Wilco that didn't really work or light it up that well, should I say. Um, but then my mum found these strip lights that I just stuck all around the side and the top and it works much better. So if you need lighting for a small space or cupboard I would definitely recommend these. Up here I keep all my jeans and trousers as well as some shoes and then on top of my drawers there's a little space for all my belts and stuff that I thought I'd show you. I have this door hanger for all my coats and jackets and this is what my room looks like at night. I think it's super cosy with all the lights. So I really hope you like this kind of video. I know it's a bit different to what I usually post but I personally love watching videos like this and I know some of you might too. I love you so much and I'll see you on my next one.